The annual observance of Ramadan is regarded as one of the five pillars of Islam to encourage the practice of self-discipline, self-control, sacrifice and empathy for those who are less fortunate. The Liri Olua organization, in conjunction with Penka's school, Lagos, organized its annual Quran competition held in honor of late Alaja Wasilat Ayindi. The third edition witnessed the presence of religious leaders, council executives, youths, scholars, as well as residents of Isolo LCDA. Participants were selected across the council area while the Islamic scholars engaged them in different recitations. <laughs> Students who performed excellently well were rewarded with gifts. Speaking with newsmen, the chairman in solo LCDA, Adebayo Olasoju, said the program is a step in the right direction towards discovering talent who have memorized the Holy Quran. Well, I believe this program is about turning people to God, turning people to remember their Creator, because there's no way you come for such a program that um, it won't turn your spirituality up. And it's an avenue to encourage our people to brush up their intellectual capacity in terms of the word of God. The program is improving yearly, and as you can see, people are really looking up onto the program. One, we had a winner last year, two years ago, three years ago. Um, and the winners are equally doing well in their chosen field. To parents, they should encourage their children to seek knowledge, either academically, spiritually, even scientifically, is the best way to go. When you are good academically, you are good spiritually, there's no way you won't have, you won't have it better than somebody who has just one. Well, firstly, I would like to thank the organizer of the competition because the competition is just one of its kind. 
and um, the participants have been scrutinized very well. I can assure you that anybody that can pass through stage of the competition can actually compete anywhere, even in the world, because the judges uh, actually scrutinize the participants very well, and it's really tasking, because um, it's, it's actually different from um, some other competition outside there. It has to do with the uh, mutashabiyat of the Quran. That's the way the Quran, uh, uh, the way they, they resemble one another. So the ability to differentiate between them is what actually makes you a perfect recital of the Quran. And if you cannot be able to differentiate between all these mutashabiyat, you can't be able to participate well in this competition. So I really thank the organizer for actually coming up with this kind of uh, initiative, as this is like a motivation to uh, our people out there, to the children out there, uh, those one who are willing to learn the Holy Quran, and all those students who are already learning the Holy Quran, for them to be able to sit tight. Alhamdulillah, I think um, by the time you look at um, the structure of um, the competition, I think it, it meets with the international standard. The people who screens the students are our um, scholars from al Azhar University in Egypt, so who are experts in the knowledge of the Quran, and um, the people who have actually been around will see the process that it has been, it has met the international standard. And I think we have, um, we are so sure that those who emerged as winners are those who actually, you know, deserve to win those prizes. Hamla, I think um, we just need to thank Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala for her life and well spent, and. Um, we thank the Honorable Chairman for the minute feet to do this because this is one of the biggest things that could have been done after her demise because it's surely the rewards will definitely be reaching her every time. So it's, 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 it's a good thing and then we pray Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that um, the reward should keep reaching her, inshallah Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and also the family that she left behind. I personally want to give kudos to the Executive Chairman of Isolo LCDA for putting together this um, Londable program um, that has been a platform where a lot of people have been led to know more of um, the Almighty Allah and to imbibe the traits that are required of a, um, um, of a devoted Muslim and um, someone that is um, you know, a believer in everything that Allah represents. So to do this in honor of my sister, who was known for her devotion to anything that is God, it's, um, you know, I score it 100%. And I just hope that um, it keeps on getting better and better and better. Because a lot of people, the students who win, the participants, the people that attend, it's always better year in, year out. This is the third edition, and um, it's just been beautiful. The memory of the event will continue to linger in the art of participants.